lightweight division, we have number nine ranked Jim Miller taking on relatively unknown yeah, uh, I, Yance, Yancey Medeiros. Yeah, I didn't. I couldn't find a lot on Medeiros. Right, so he, he's only research. had um, he's only had a couple fights in the UFC. I think one of those was a no contest. So as far as UFC fights go, there's not a whole lot to go on. Um, so I don't know much about him, but I do know that Jim Miller is a beast. He's been very impressive, uh, a very um, very experienced UFC fighter, and uh, from what I can tell, Medeiros likes to stand and strike. Mm -hmm. Uh, which Jim Miller certainly can do, but Jim Miller can also take you down. Uh, and I think at this point, he's going to take Medeiros down at will and, uh, and submit him. So my prediction for this fight is uh, Jim Miller by submission, possibly even in the first round. Well, again, maybe even though you didn't look at my notes, mm -hmm. uh, your notes are very similar to mine. Like How mind, or great minds are not here in this room. Right, they're not here, but <laughs> apparently they do think alike when they are together. <laughs> Uh, I'm the same way. I like Miller. He is a he's a grappler. He'll take you down. He submits you. Uh, Thirteen submission victories mm -hmm. in his 23, 4, and 0 career in mixed martial arts. But he's not afraid to go toe to toe. I mean, if you oh, want, no. you want to punch with him, he'll punch you back and he'll punch hard. And I do. I think he'll be. I think he'll overwhelm uh, Medeiros. And I think this one actually will probably end fairly quickly. I won't give a round prediction. Right. I wrote one down, but I'm gonna I'm gonna keep that to myself. But I do think it's Miller by submission.